Welcome student. Let's start with calculus. Calculus is a branch of mathematics that includes the study of limits, derivatives, integrals and infinite series. It is basically just very advanced algebra and geometry. Calculus includes two major branches, differential calculus and integral calculus. And today we are going to start with differential calculus. Let's see the physical meaning of derivatives. Derivatives is a measure of how a function changes when the values of its input changes. For example, velocity is nothing but is the rate of change of position with respect to time. If s is the distance covered in time t, then velocity is given by derivative of distance with respect to time. Let's look at the mathematical equation to find the derivative of a function at number a. f dash a equals to limit as h approaches to 0 f of a plus h minus f of a over h. If this limit exists, then we take x equals to a plus h, where h is infinitesimal small value. So, in other words, we define derivative as small change in the function with respect to one of its variables. Now let's see by an example how to find the derivative of function fx equals to x square minus 5x plus 3. Simply use the formula f dash x equals to limit as h approaches to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x whole divided by h. Simply plug in the values of x as x plus h and x in the given function and take their difference. Now divide the whole by h. Simplify by cancelling out the like terms and you will reach limit as h approaches to 0 h square plus 2xh minus 5h over h. Take h common from the numerator so as to cancel with the h in the denominator and you will reach limit as h approaches to 0 h plus 2x minus 5. Put in the value of h equals to 0 and you will get 2x minus 5 as the derivative of the given equation. Now let's see one more example how to find the derivative of equation 3x squared plus 2x. Simply use the formula of derivatives that is f dash x equals to limit as h approaches to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x over h. Now simply plug in the values of x as x plus h and x in the given equation and then take their difference and then divide the whole by h. Now simplify further by cancelling out the like terms and you will reach f dash x equals to limit as h approaches to 0 3h square plus 6xh plus 2h over h. Now simplify further by cancelling out the h from the numerator and h from the denominator and you will reach limit as h approaches to 0 3h plus 6x plus 2. Now put h equals to 0 and you will get 6x plus 2 as the derivative of 3x square plus 2x. Now let's learn how to find out an equation of a tangent to a curve. As we know, derivative of a function representing a curve gives us the slope of the tangent to that curve. Now here we need to find out the equation of tangent to the curve y equals to fx at point a comma fa. 
Now simply plug in the values of slope in the point slope form of a line so as to get the equation of the tangent to the curve. Let's see an example how to find equation of a tangent to the given curve. Here the curve is y equals to x square minus 5x plus 3 and the point is 3 comma 6. Follow the step 1. Just simply find out the derivative of the given curve and you will reach 2x minus 5. Now to find the slope of the given tangent, just put the value of x as 3 in the given derivative and you will get slope as 1. Now put this value of slope in point slope form of a line that is y minus y1 equals to m times x minus x1 and you will reach y equals to x plus 3 which is the equation of the tangent to the given curve. Let's see one more example how to find equation of a tangent to the given curve. Here the curve is y equals to 3x square plus 2x and the point is 1 comma 4. Simply follow the first step that is find out the derivative of the given curve and you will reach 6x plus 2. Now to find the slope of a given tangent just put the value of x as 1 in the given derivative and you will get the slope as 8. Now put this value of slope in this point slope form of a line that is y minus y1 equals to m times x minus x1 and you will reach y equals to 8x minus 4 which is the equation of a tangent to the curve y equals to 3x square plus 2x at point 1 comma 4. Till now we were finding out a derivative of a function at a fixed point. Now let's see how to find derivative of a function with respect to variable x that is given as limit as x approaches to 0 change in value of y over change in value of x. Now let's look at the different notations of derivatives of a function y equals to fx with respect to x that is dfx or dy over dx or f dash x or dy where symbol d over dx is the differentiation operator. Let's look at an example to find out the derivative of a function y equals to x square minus x. As we know, derivative of a function is limit as h approaches to 0 change in value of function with respect to the change in value of variable. Now simply plug in the values of x as x plus h and x in the given function and take their difference and then divide the whole by h. Now simplify by cancelling out the like terms and you will reach limit as h approaches to 0 h square plus 2xh minus h over h. Now simplify further by taking h common from numerator so as to cancel with the h in the denominator and we will reach till 2x minus 1 which is the derivative of the given function. That's all for today. We are going to continue next time. Thank you, take care and bye-bye.